Hello and welcome to another Green Giant Tactical review video. Uh, today I'm going to be covering an item which will become more of a use towards the summer months uh, when plate carriers and chess rigs become highly impractical due to the heat and want to cool down a bit but still want to be able to carry all your gear with you. Um, I have a GFC tactical bag. Um, it looks like it's an, one of the more expensive models, but it's not. It costs uh, near £25, which is quite excellent for what it has. Okay, starting from the top and the back, you have a large Velcro patch. So I've put a couple of patches on there. That's more than adequate for what you need. Uh, you've got a large front pocket. I should have done this before. Um, with, so you've got a large front pocket there. And that's seriously large. I have been carrying a Coleman's propane bottle in there, plus a couple of bottles of BBs uh, with relative ease and still having plenty of space left over. So it's plenty to do enough. Uh, you've then got, you can see, mole loops on the sides, so you can have pouches, or in, the, in my case, I put my radio on the side and then have everything going through the straps at the top. Inside the main compartment, if I can get that to focus, uh, you've got a Velcro retaining patch up here for any cables and so on. Uh, then a nice pouch at the back, uh, probably attributed to a mat pouch. Then hidden away under the straps at the front, you have another pouch. Velcro is away. Yeah. So, go away like that, big pouch at the back, and that is designed to hold a water carrier that also comes with this. Um, it's currently drying it, so I won't bother fapping that with that. It's a uh, standard 3 litre water carrier, it's not great quality, but it will do, because frankly you get in the bag and a water carrier for 25 quid. Um, uh, some other key features to note on that, where you've got the Velcro in there, you've actually got a slot to put your pipes through, so you're keeping them away from the rest of your equipment, whatever's in the bag, so it's not going to cause any issues with leaks and so on. I didn't find this out until after I'd used it and put the uh, water carrot in the main section of the bag and the leak going and stuff, so I'll just put that one for you. Um, you've got plenty of uh, High quality IPW style, I say IPW style because they're cheap plastic, it's not it's cheap plastic but it's strong enough it does the job. Uh, they wrap across the front meaning you can attach stuff to the outside of the bag relatively easily and also use them as compression straps, which is probably what they're intended for. Uh, on the actual front of the bag we've got a nice strong carry handle at the top, um, that's not going to pull away easily despite the thing that the entire bag seems to be made in probably a minimum of 500 feet uh, nylon, so should last a while. Um, okay, on the straps themselves, you've got loops down this side, which are for your water carriers uh, or your hydration carriers pipe. You've got plenty of strap adjustment, uh, some points to put carabiners and so on. Then same again on the other side, I would run a uh, radio cable and so on through that to a PGT to keep it out of the way. Um, on the back, you have these straps, which are so that you can grab the straps yourselves and actually, because you can detach these from the bottom. Um, got multiple points with push button uh, retainers on the bottom, so you can change the length of the pull you've got on the straps. Um, but then you've also got the ability to tie those away along the bot on the back of the bag and just use this as a carry bag. Um, not sure why, but uh, they put it on there. Uh, you also have a rather ridiculously large waistband on this, uh, like so. Uh, just to give you an idea, and this is fully extended, you could have fit me and a couple of other people inside this with relative ease. And this is even, this is about as small as I can get it, so if you're intended to use this as a small person, it's probably not going to work for the waistband, but it's not the end of the world because you've got this 
all these straps here which actually fit these right around up here if you're tall because well yeah they're not it's a tiny little bag so um just a quick overview if you want to consider it um these are available on uh, gunfire.pl uh, where they'll cost you uh, I think it's 28 euros and then you've got to pay about another five euros for shipping or you can get them like i did through um Mad Dog S off in front of the temperature, or go through their Facebook page, which I'll link in the video uh, description below. Um, but that's the end of this brief coverage. Uh, if you'd like to uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel, uh, follow us on uh, follow us on Twitter, and then like us on Facebook. The links will be in the description below. And uh, yeah, thank you. And until next time.